What's up guys, what's going on? It is episode number three, season number three, go. Tone of my voice, K Black, the camp out. We here every Thursday on a Thursday, 8 p.m. We good? Yeah, we good. Chilling? Let's do, uh, I'm gonna do some shout outs just to uh, open up the show real quick because I feel like you guys won't wait till the end anyway. So uh, shout out to Milton, shout out to Scruff God, new artwork coming soon. Hopefully, it might be this week, I'm not sure yet because I haven't edited. Uh, maybe next week, but either way, new artwork is coming. Check out Scruff. Uh, thank you very much. And uh, shout out to Vlad the Mayor also. Shout out to Tone. Shout out to KB. And let's get it going. Thursday, uh, a lot of shoes are dropping, so we're going to get into that first, even though I, I like to skip over Thursday since it's Thursday night. And if you missed it, it's a little too late. But, but it might uh, be on the shelf. You know, you don't know. It, it might still be sitting there because a lot of shit did drop today. We'll start with uh, Nike Vapor Max Hyper Punch. It was a Paris exclusive. Uh, it's a wider release now, and I kind of like the colorway, not gonna lie, and I like Vapor Max. How do you feel about like the first release being just exclusive to like one city and then having a worldwide release afterwards? I don't, I don't mind that at all. You don't care about it? No. Well, I don't care about it either. I think it's good when you know more people to marry. Yeah. Yep. Like color? No. No? Yes. All right. Next up, uh, Vapor Max Chinese New Year. Uh, as you guys already know, beginning of the year, Chinese New Year always has some kind of drop. Uh, Vapor Max again, looks like an anthracite gray with uh, <clears throat> a little barrage of color in the I guess the welded technology in the upper midsole area. Kind of dope. I like them. Call I hate them. This is why. Next up, Chinese New Year, Kyrie 4. What is it? Ky yeah, Kyrie 4. You want, you want me to do it? Or? <laughs> well, no. Nah, I, I don't know if you're going to read all of them. I don't know. I, 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 I kind of like them. I'm Shut saying, the fuck up. Yeah, this I, I, is I, strange. Are you fucking serious? I, I, I kind of like it. I was waiting for why, it. Why? Because it's red and pink? Yeah. And the flowers? Yeah. You like this? Yeah, I like the colorway, but I hate the silhouette. Well, yeah, I don't like yo, the shoe, but I, I like the yo, design on the shoe. You, you you're buying a Coke right now? You're like shaking. What are you talking about? This is the fucking Red Bull. <laughs> what do you buy? Though? Instead of drinking, uh, I'm gonna drink some of yours. No, 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 no. Right. You should buy it. Like wear it. I mean, I, I definitely will. And not... give the people a performance <laughs> review playing basketball and okay. that shit. Have you seen me move quickly? Never. That's why I say you should do a performance You've review. You've never seen me move. How quickly. funny Yo, would it be? Red Bulls, you might move quickly. If you want to see the camp, I'll do a basketball performance review. Let us know in the comments below, and I'm pretty sure if we get enough people to say yes, he'll probably do it. <laughs> you want a basketball court dribbling down half court doing no, a layup, do and I come out of nowhere and I smack the shit out of you, foul. Uh, uh, you, I, I'm a, I you, you know, there might be like a, like a like a video that rolls up to me in the gym, like fucking doing shit to make sure <laughs> that never fucking happens. Uh, but I, I guess, it, yeah, whatever, fuck it. Yo, um, I would love to see you wear these shoes though on the court. I, I'm I'm not mad at. I just don't like the silhouette. I, I mean, a basketball court, not like a court of law. But this is this is the problem here. See what's going on? No. And we're not talking about shoes anymore. All right. <laughs> uh, next up, there was supposed to be this weekend. We had 98s, Air Max 98s, oh, the Gundam, man. and the other color. Uh, apparently, Nike has pushed the release date to the 24th. So we're going to scrub that from here. Uh, they make my size. Next up, I'm, the, the I'm one that's sure they come grade school. Yeah. But uh, the Gundam shit is fire. Any Gundam. The Tor Yellow is, is all right. It's nice, but this one's better. Yeah. I like this. Is that navy blue or black? It's navy blue. Oh, so that's, that's even better. Yeah. Oh, we tried them all. Oh yeah. shit! Watch out! Fire! Oh, we tried them all. West at? NYC. Yeah, yeah, West. Shout West out to West on the uh, the shelf. So shout out to. Uh, oh, yeah. West has them right now available. They ha well, I put it up on my Insta story. I didn't see it. All right, next. Anyway, uh, the ones that are dropping, the '98s that are dropping, are the women's pair. Uh, oh, they fossil. What? Uh, kind like of fire, them. yeah. I like them. I don't know. I feel like the off white because cream. it's off white, it makes it look like yellow to me. So. Well, that's that's off white. Off white is like a cream. Someone say off white. Yellow color. Oh, because not off white collapsing guys. Yellow. On yellow and off white is two different things. That's why two different names, you know? Yellow, off white. Or it could be beige. But it, it's fossil, I don't know. so. Whatever, I just don't it's like it. It's like a bone. It's a bone. Hey, hey, hey how you doing there, buddy? Uh, next up, we got a Nike Hyper Adapt in three different colorways um, Weak, Weak, and Weak Err. I think I've seen an Earl on the fucking outlet. Like, like somebody posted up a photo, but like Earl's on the outlet. Two G's worth of whackness. Yeah, it's a little more than. Two G's. Or each one's like 700, right? 750, yeah. that's 2100 for three pairs plus tax. So like 2400, and I'm good. That shit was a wild. Digital camo. Like one pair of both white <laughs> That's on the feet of colorway right there. Super pass. Uh, next up, we got a uh, it's a re release uh, Nike SB that's Dunk Mid Louis Marnell. Who was uh, Louis Marnell? The skater, skateboarder. That's it, just nobody I mean, uh, significant. I think he passed, he passed away. Okay. Uh, because of diabetes uh, complications with like his diabetes oh, that sucks. Um, in 13 and he this was his favorite model uh, so the basically yeah, I think they re-released for him and um, there's an in the insignia on the heel yeah, yeah, uh, like a the insignia yeah. is for it's it, it's something that they they dubbed just for him for one of his collabs what is or it it's just his like brand anyway it, it's dope I like the wheat colorway it looks clean 
I don't like uh, I don't like the SB mids at all. I feel like they changed with that strap. The shape I don't like that strap. They definitely changed the shape a little bit. Like it looks like a dunk in the front now. Moving right along, Air Max 97 uh, with the Italian flag on the gold pair. Definitely fire. I missed the silver pair. Super exclusive to Italy. Um, it looks like J Pash tried this morning and he struck out at three different locations. So it's going to be another hard one to cop. Hopefully. Uh, shout out to J Pass. What up? Shout out to. I thought that's what I was doing. No, no, no. But, but uh, <laughs> just because they put the Italian flag on it, it makes it 100 times. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're biased to this. So. It's the same shit, it's just... It's the same age, that's why, that's why I passed. Yeah. What? Because I have the gold ones, I mean, like, yeah, they're Yeah, there's no so point in getting that. It is the same it's exact so, shit. It's the same exact shit, what do yeah, you mean? We're Italian there's flag. different pull tabs. I got yeah. Italy camo, those are better. I got Italian flag on that. Ooh. Just saying. Shitting on my whole parade today. Or, uh, next up, uh, another pushed release. Uh, Adidas Futurecraft 4D Ash Green. Um, I, I like the shoe, the triple black up top with the mint. Just it's not, it's not triple black, it's just double black up it top. It looks and blue. Huh? It looks what? blue in this picture. What looks blue? Upper. Huh? It's black? It's blue. Yo, are you on crack? Is it blue or black? It's black, it's black. Right, but Why does it look blue? Maybe because of the fucking... The lighting. The kid at it. I don't know. Oh, God. What the fuck you want to tell Whatever. So, rumor was that the 4D shit wasn't supposed to drop, and now they finally got the approval to I, drop it. I don't know if they got the approval Some approval. Like, shit. it was supposed to be a wider release, and then they dropped it down to 300 pairs because mm. of, I think... I think, don't quote me on this one, uh, they were only supposed to do a certain amount of them as per the people that created the 4D technology. Oh, for like the contract? Yeah, stuff. for like their contract. And then when they got, when they realized that they were mass producing them, they put a fucking cease and desist and in a lawsuit. So I guess they pulled back to the original number and now they're dropping that. Oh, wow. But I'll, I'll try and get some more details. To be continued. Retail's 300. 300 pairs only. Resell's like. Pumping? Cause I like them. Resells like dollars is like a pump. Yeah, it's I'm super excited for three hundred dollars right? sneakers. Well, I mean, you you guys pay higher for resells, so I mean, fuck yeah, right for like certain things. I for hype piece shit. Yeah, yeah. This is not a hype piece shoe. It is. Oh, yeah, okay. and people are gonna pay three thousand dollars for this shit. That's how much they're going for. They go for like three G's right now. Three. If it's not retail, it's not for me. Um, well, of course, uh, uh, nobody in the right mind. Like, I mean, on this shoe, uh, on this shoe, if it's not retail, it's not for me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I don't, I don't think that paying that price. It's not for worth it, it, though. Yeah, if it was off white and it was something I really wanted, it's oh, a different boy. story. Like, why do I get called the hype beast? He's not hype beast. I'm I call both of you hype beast. I'm just saying, fun. like, when the when the you're a hype beast, Rock, Rockefeller number one. That's, That's the hype beast number one. So when the off whites <laughs> dropped and I was super excited, like certain shit, I was super excited for. I like the Vapor Max, I like the One, and I like the Presto. Those were like my. I top think the three. '90s were well constructed out of all. It, of those. Oh, it's, but I'm saying like when they dropped, I was like not on some hypey shit. I was like, damn, those shits Why are fire. Why are we fire. talking about off white right now? Fuck. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm beating a dead horse right now. Are we supposed to be staying on this topic? Yeah, yeah. What are we up to? Yeah, take over. Sacconi, Shadow, Soulbox, Five Hundred, EPR. Sockily. Well, how, how do you feel about them? This, feel, is why, this is why I read I them. Tone, tone talks, and I just get irritated, and I just lose track of my track. Of, yeah, track of what I'm gonna say. If you guys would stop fucking flirting and continue doing flirting, the fucking show, stop it. Would be it. <laughs> don't say I'm shit dead, like that, I'm though. Uh, I'll okay. put in my two weeks. Soulbox, Sockney, Shadow, uh, Five Thousand, Evolution. Uh, Pink Devil. So if you guys know, uh, they did a shoe the years ago. Was it? Uh, was, was Why it would they do this bullshit? Well, I don't know what year it was, but anyway, the original is, is super fire. Then they did this hybrid. It's not good. No. It's not even like it's close a, to good. It's a. It's just trash. Oh wow. That's, that's it's a. Uh, it's way. fucking horrible. They should have just did like a, another colorway, like another collab on the five regular I don't five thousand. Don't give me this. Is, this is still Thursday, shit. by the way, so we're gonna shit. keep moving on. Tyler, the creator, Converse One Star. Le Fleur. Le Fleur. Uh, uh, do you, do you, if uh, you're a hippie, if you're a hippie, then they're kind of fire. What do you mean hippie? What's the definition of hippie? Yeah, word. I think Colors, I'm sitting next to one. Rugged. Smoking pot. Mad, getting mad. high. I mean, someone in here could be a hippie. You know what I'm saying? One out of three people in your group is a hippie. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty good. Um, anyway, they got three colors. It's blue, it's green, it's pink. Fire. I I'm with them. I don't like them. Fuck Can these. Pals. Super pals. We know you like the little... Elf. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, I'm just kidding. You like the dainty shit. LC23 <laughs> and Diodora, N9000 and Heritage. Um, N9000 Heritage and Be Elite coming Ooh. out uh, in a denim pack. Um, I like the N9000, the B Elite. If I had to pick the, the N9000, it's yeah. definitely nice. fine. It's good contrasting with the denim and the 
the little tan suede on the toe box. It's just fine. I like it. Beely, not so much. No, I don't. I really not. Nah, I just realized that. my shoes are not gonna work with the green screen. Oh fuck! So you're gonna have to like. You should put it like in your chest then, like when you show like. No, just take a picture of them, put them up. Uh, anyway. You guys are mad fancy <coughs> with that shit. Y'all did that shit to me last week. You no, put no, glamour no. shots of her fucking Air Max. <laughs> and I get this crazy. shit right here. And then Dab's got fucking pictures in his dark ass cave. It's, like, it's, what the fuck, dog? I can't get some glamour the green shots? Screen we'll take them before you leave. Don't lie. Fuck you. Uh, <laughs> next up, do the last one for Thursday. Today's release release is would be Dover Street Market, oh, DSM, God. and Nike Air yeah. Max 1 3 colorways. A white. Triple trash. <laughs> there you go. Kristen Taylor. A navy way. and a black. I'm, I'm not mad at it. You can't. I'm super mad at it. Are you crazy? Right Why? DSM, like I know DSM. The whole black and white. Their whole vibe is like simplistic, <laughs> white, black, black and navy. Yeah, like fuck that shit, though. Like they wasted this whole Air Max collab on a bullshit ass DSM. They could have gave it to somebody else and this. Well, it's just way like that better. boomer I got that Ronnie did that collab. Yeah, them shit is whack too, though. They look good with like the tri. The what a fuck. The black fucking, and the white soul. The Pumas. The he DSM came out Pumas. All white. He came out all black. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, yes, it was yes. just stupid trash. I love those. Shut up. I actually do like those. I would They're my favorite oh, Pumas. For anyway, Pumas. moving right along to Friday. Nike yeah, Zoom. Yeah, yeah, yo. What? Because you guys don't shut the fuck up. Uh, Nike it's Zoom Fly Sophia it's Stone. <laughs> Uh, it's a pretty good colorway, a little tan, got a little oh, yeah. 3M flicker. I mean, if you were paying fly. attention, what the this fuck is going on? <laughs> pretty cool, pretty cool. Pretty good, pretty, uh, pretty, pretty nice. Where are you we? Want to do... <laughs> I already said it should strive, so... It's Friday, like... it's Friday, it's Friday. Let's go, KB, okay, let's do it. Read it. We're going, he said it already. I didn't no, say no, shit. No, no, read it, it's oh, right here. Times New Bell is 991.5. So, Concepts Times New Bell is $250. That's it. Like, they look like dad shoes. Do you, do you notice how the price was in N.A.? I think it's dad shoes. I feel what? like dad, they look kind of daddish. I like the colorway though. They're for dilfs? <laughs> that was a funny ass word. <laughs> the fact that you're using it is even funnier. <laughs> yeah, Just saying. Um, okay, concepts, new balance, usually fire. Uh, material doesn't look the most premium. Uh, I will say that the 1500 midsole really doesn't do much for me on it, but it doesn't throw it off for me either, so I don't really... It threw it off for me a lot. They could have used a regular 990 midsole, because with the be 1500... <laughs> I know, I understand that, but the with, the, with the hybrid shit, it's giving it a banana shape, and I can't fuck with that. Oh, you, it's a no-go for me. I'm not going to finish that. Today. Yeah, don't, don't do that. Uh, okay. Well, you want to move to Saturday? Let's move to Saturday. Saturday, Nike Air Phone uh, Pocket uh, 1 PRM. Premium. What is Abalone. that? Abal Abal Did you say premium? Yeah. Oh, boy. It's all premium to me. I mean, how no, premium, but I mean, how premium, that's PRM, that's what it is. How, how could premium, premium be a phone pocket? I know, it's I don't know, but it's just, doesn't, it's just something they put to fucking... They'll, they'll put this. premium, they'll raise the price by like $15. What would they put, like, a little extra... It might be suede. Yeah, it might, it might, <laughs> it might be, be cardboard, I don't know. It looks kind of... You know, no lie, the print texture. is fire, but... The print, the print is kind of nice. It's, it's just, nice. It's a phone posit, so... I, I don't wear foams anymore. I'm over that. That the foams? Yeah. Shout out. Shout out to the phones. Um, Nike Zoom Fly in this. Um, Retail for 150 It's a purple, pink, and a white midsole. There you go. A little see through okay, this action. This is where I'm going to call it hype piece. If you're wearing a Zoom Fly off white, just because it's off white, you're a hype piece because that shit is trash. It's it's same thing for pretzels. Pretzels are trash. It's and very you're comfortable. comfortable. No, they are not. They are very not trash. This is comfortable, but very I don't like the way it looks. I, if they would have fit me, I would have kept them. I mean, it's a, it's a true running shoe. It's not something to get jiggy with. You weren't upset when you couldn't keep them, though. No, not really. If it was a Presto that you couldn't keep, you would have been, I'm going to get another one. I'm going to get my size. Yeah, I completely agree with okay, you, so but I wasn't cool. really hyped about it to begin it's with. Like, it's like the last of them, like the last of Mohicans. Like, if it's what's left, people got to get it. Get the hell out of here. I'm going to go grab another one. I don't want your germs on my drink. I ain't getting no Red Bull. Fuck this. Yeah, now I really want it. <laughs> Great. United Arrows and Sun and United Arrows and Suns. Yeah, that's the company. NMD City Sock 2, 220. It looks like a regular GR shoe to me. There's an Oreo color, it's just trash. Agreed. Move along. <clears throat> Go ahead, United KB. Arrows and Suns Adidas NMD R2. What's that 220. Like? Nike Tech Fleece on it? It's just trash. Pass. Agreed. What's Keep going. What's next? Puma Titan Go. times Michael Lau. Lau. Suede classic sample suede. Kind of nice. The suede is nice. The colorway is nice, but... Yes. What was the 50th what, anniversary of like Puma? I don't wear those. I'm going to start wearing them just because they're this guy. I'm just there. saying. It, it looks like... It, just because I don't wear a shoe doesn't mean I can't appreciate it. I just said good. it's nice. Oh, okay. I think it's trash. I think it's nice. Fuck yourself. Fuck you. Uh, um, he, he, he does these. 
Oh shit, I got the, the iPad now. Air Jordan 13 Olive, uh, first time ever, this shit is whack. Uh, they could have did way better. They should have left the 3M panels on the side, it would have been way better. Mm. Instead of having a little suede on the upper. The 3M, the 3M always makes it better for the 13s. Yeah, I'm just lit. But, they could have did much better, but fuck it. They they dropped the ball as usual. Roddy 5 Timberland also dropping this Saturday, limited 300 pairs, allegedly, right? Yeah. Uh, we got a navy blue, Allegiant. we got a 240 below, triple black, and then a rust colorway. The, what is it, this deconstructed fucking leather and shit or whatever. Oh yeah, it's said. uh, uh that word? This shit is fire. Yeah. I like the tan one, yeah. out of those three. Word. But I, retail, what is it, like 500 for the 40 below? Stop it. 300, no? It's gonna be like 300, three, I'd say three, right, three, three and 350, somewhere in there. I don't yeah, like these six inches. Six inch, I know it has a pebble, uh, navy yeah. blue, new buck. So in hand, they yeah. look very, very good. The navy pair, I just don't like that overflowing mm -hmm. top. Of the Shirley? That it makes is it not how little, they usually look. Usually you got the leather tab up top and then it... Goes with a little fur coming up. The Apple Sherpa starts underneath. Nice starting. The shoes with the fur, with the fur. Go ahead, Mike, you know the song. Stop playing. Once again, I don't know what he's talking about. That was his about. time. <laughs> My time. I fucking hate that guy anyway. Anyway, the 40 below is definitely fire in hand. Everything made very well. Construction is nice. There's a black line shirt, but inside the black pair, both of them very, very dope. Uh, there's apparel as well. There's long sleeves and a hoodie to match each of the long sleeves. So it's three and three, uh, navy, um, brown color, and a camo. Clean, very, very, very it's clean. Fire with the kids with the Timberland. Yeah, looks good. The only reason I really don't like 40 below is that big ass Timberland logo on the ankle. Uh, right. Those are fire though. That. Can't front. I could front. We should try. I said can't front. That's not, you just said you'd wear them. I know it was a joke. Damn. <laughs> Yo, fun. you got some fans. Could I, I get that? Someone was going hard. You said talk shit about it, or somebody went hard. Yes. Anyway, uh, that's gonna be it so for power. this weekend's releases. Tone, could I get a? Afterthoughts. You want this? That was quick. I'm gonna give it to you. Ooh, Afterthoughts. Pause. There you go. Super pause. <laughs> There might even be a pause button on the screen right now. Anyway, um, drunk right now? <laughs> Instagram and Twitter next week on like Monday or Tuesday, I will be putting up a poll because you guys did not give a definitive answer on what you wanted to see for the sneaker battle. Uh, Asics were like the common denominator amongst everybody kind of talking. And then it was like New Balance. Nobody really said Asics, I mean Adidas or Nike too much. Good. So uh, we're going to do Asics this week and then I'll make a poll for next week on like Monday or Tuesday on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, next up, Eli Goldman. For, for the poll, what are you going to do? Just two I'm, different I'm, brands? No, I'm going to put two? up like what, whatever we want to do. Okay. I'll put up like whatever, those two things and we'll make a poll. Gotcha. All right, Roger that. So much harder to pick shoes when you... 10 four. Eli Gomez and Lou both commented last week that they would like to do some editing. So if you guys can contact me, hit me up. Lou, I, I'm just put it, whatever, anyway. Uh, questions. You guys want to do questions? Or? Sure. You want to read Did one? you get any funny ones this week? Mm, no. Nah. You want to read uh, one? You want to read? Uh, here you go. I'll try to read. All right. <coughs> Orlando Mendoza six days ago. You want to read that six days ago, too? Yeah. No? Well, then let's get to the part where you have to read something. We'll All right. Do you think that 2018 will see the revival of runners in terms of New Balance, Deodora, A6? Saucony, etc. It seems that the market is so saturated and not even Ronnie can save it. Well, I don't think Ronnie's <laughs> trying to save it. I don't think Ronnie's trying to save it. I think Ronnie's more going direction with his like clothing right now. I don't think he was saying that Ronnie's trying to save it. He He's saying that, that Ronnie couldn't save it. Yeah. Oh. Not even Ronnie. Yeah, no. Can save it. They're not even doing anything for July fives. Like they're taking July threes off the shelf. For real? That's what I heard. Ooh. So there's a lot of rumors and Sneaker speculation. Rumors. See what you did there. Yeah. Uh, a lot of rumors and speculation. <laughs> I don't think that the runners can do any more than they're already doing. The problem with like the runner brands is that their inline is their income. So doing collaborations doesn't bring a lot to the brand itself except for notoriety. Um, I noticed with Asics, they dropped a Del Diablo. They had a couple of collaborations. Or bringing just a, back the Saga this year. Just a Ronnie. And then you saw a whole bunch of dope colorways for inline. Um, that is not the way to get people to follow the trend. Like, <clears> like <throat> Nike does inline Air Max 97. They can sell that out because you'll see inline stuff from 20 years ago that people like still hype for. Yeah. Uh, Asics, I don't think, has that pull. I don't think Saucony has that pull. Uh, Jazz would be like their most fucking notarized thing from 20 years ago for me and it's not very appealing and, and it's not very exactly so it, it's hard to get that kind of that trending follow or whatever the fuck you want to go with to get people hyped about it i i, I don't they'd have to do more collabs and less of their less focus on their inline stuff i think a lot of the inline shit starting to look like collabs but the material is not no 
of the like they're, they're collaborations. Even, they're doing collab materials as well, but nobody's paying attention to them because collabs collab. have become the new GR. So like yeah. it's 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 hard to spend the hundred thirty bucks on a shoe that's in line when I could spend one hundred fifty on a collaboration. Yeah. But also, it's like everything in life. Like it's a cycle. It goes out. It'll come back. Eventually, yeah. it'll come back. But just right now, it's pretty dead. Runners have their own group of people. Like that would buy this shit like religiously. Weird, by the way. What? What the? <sighs> like, <laughs> no, I had to fucking be the, the hairspray is still like lingering. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I had to get like oxygen somehow before I started. No, 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 I'm sorry. Yeah, fuck you. So, I think there's nothing that these brands could do that could probably like bring the inline release like up to like the hype of the the collabs and shit. Collabs is what people want. It's people desire collabs. They want the limited shit all the time, no matter what. It could be a collaboration triple white shoe and that shit would sell out eventually. Like you. Exactly. The Rockefeller. Yeah, but it, it was one. It was a GR. Mm. It's just it's, sat. You, you really like, you really just sold yourself on that. I know. No, I did it. I, I, I still have it. It could be a triple white shoe and it'll still sell out. Like, yeah. <laughs> but it's Rockefeller. It's I see what we just said. Yo, thank you, thank you, thank you. Bro. Top seventeen and <laughs> seventeen. It's the rock. I'll throw it up, I'll throw it up it's with just, you, but it's not all white over here, you heard? It's, it's the rock. Rock if you can put your finger over it and it's not there anymore. That's okay, but I still fuck with Air Force. I mean, I don't want to throw off your train of thought here. Okay, you already did. I know. <laughs> I didn't mean to, but it was just... Fucking bitch. It was too easy. Fuck it. Do more collabs. <laughs> A6 fire. Salkany's fire. Salkany fell off completely. New Balance is dope, but I'm sure it's always go on sale. But New it's made in USA. New Balance is rude for their price points, though. But it's made in USA, made in UK. And, like, that price point is high up there. There's just no hype for, like, New Balance like that. I, I, I get it. I get it. I'd rather pay 180 for a premium material. I feel like New Balance will never go out of style because even if they make an old man shoe, which a lot of it's people like, like, like dad shoe shit, like I can still rock yeah. a dad shoe and kill that shit. Like it don't matter. Oh, like, word? You can kill a dad shoe? From, from New uh, Balance? Hell fucking yeah. What dad shoes do you have? I'm just saying. If they put out like, a, navy, dad shoes. a navy New Balance. Not, like you think that the city never sleeps isn't a dad shoe? No. no. I don't think so. I don't think that's a dad shoe. Old navy with a white midsole, like that's. You it has black on it too. Yeah, it does. Okay, navy black. black, and navy. black. It has it's wax. Like a royal blue. It has wax at least. Like yeah, but that means absolutely <laughs> nothing. As far as colorway and aesthetic goes, there's nothing that pops that an old. What what is a dad shoe? I don't know. I don't really call shoes dad shoes. It's a monotone shoe that an older man would wear. Monotone yeah. or monochrome? That, that could be. What, what did I say? Monotone? Yeah, you said monotone. You were thinking fucking about me. Red Bull. Monochrome shoe <laughs> that basically anybody you can wear. Like it's just like a fucking monarch. I think the shoe. definition of dad shoes are like big, bulky, <clears throat> miso, wide fucking shoes that look like shit that you wear like to go get groceries or no, like you're driving a minivan and shit. Like, like dad shoes. Like dad shoes are else. like that big, bulky, like mon monarchs. Those are dad shoes. I mean, they, they you see call, how bulky that shit is? They call dad hats dad hats. Like, can somebody I mean, please write in the comments what a dad shoe is? But, but in, in theory, like in, in my own perception of what a dad shoe could be, it is dad shoe could be. It's just basically a shoe that you can wear all the time. I don't think that's what it is. I, I, I think We're that's a dad shoe. So you can wear Air Force Ones all the time, and it won't make it a dad shoe. It's we could wear a pair of Jell Like three like GRs. I, would say like I, I know a plenty of dads model. that wear Air Force Ones all the time. Yeah, yeah, but we know plenty of dads that wear everything. Monarchs. Time and to change it. Anything could be a dad shoe. And nine nine zero. No, I don't, I don't know. I don't think anything. I'm not no, not no off white. The show's over. We have to look for dead. I don't know about off white. Don't say off white because you might offend somebody. Yo, how many times are you guys gonna say off white today? I don't say anything. I've, he he's a little salty about the off white. He get the ones. He's very upset. We gonna tell you. Don't add them. What's the, what's the next question? What's the next, the next one? Question. Here we go. <laughs> uh, shout out to Knack. What? Sorry about butchering your name, but speed. Knack T. You got it. Knack T. Uh, anyway, we addressed the overkill last week and nobody knew what it was about, so he got into the comment section and let us know that 9317 was inspired by Berlin Public Transportation, which is has a lot of graffiti on it, and most people pick up their spray cans and materials for doing graffiti from the uh, overkill shop. Also, the shoes have the ticket for transportation in the shoe, so if you wear them every day, which is a $1,300 ticket, it's one year that, that you can use these shoes to have transportation. I don't understand. So, like I say, I wear them today, and then I don't wear them tomorrow, I can't get them. You have to have the shoes on. So I have to wear the shoes every day to get on the train. Oh, you just bring the, train, bring the no, shoes no, with you? They, 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 um, your, your shoe, uh, you just got the shoe in your bag, it's not valid. You have to have them on. That's Ooh. pretty dope, though. It's I'm super fine. Like, at least you get, like, a year's wear out of your shoes. But what if they don't last a year? You're, like, fucked her. I wouldn't wear them every day. But anyway, I appreciate you getting in the comment section and let us know exactly what yeah, was going on with the you. shoe because I That's didn't know dope. that So is we so high for this shit, then? Because it's a fucking It should be $1,300. Like, <laughs> who's going to, like, legit wear them every day? Yeah. I mean, you, dads. <laughs> oh it's a dad shoe. 
guys. Dude, I did that? All right, go ahead, next question. Hey, you could be that shit. Next question, shout out to Matthew Courant. Are you excited to see the Air Max 98 being re-retroed, and do you think you will see, or it will see, collaborations to the extent of the 97 from last year? Um, yes and no. Uh, I, I hope that they stay with inline colorways or just retro colorways and doing that with premium materials. Uh, and if they're going to do collaborations with stores, they're not the same stores they did collaborations on the 97 with. Like, well, they change colors. Like, okay, well, Undefeated has three colors. They use all three colors. I like, I, I, I mean, on the 97. I, I'm just trying to think who else could... They're still doing 97s, as a matter of fact. They're doing the Ronaldo again. They just oh, dropped the... Yeah. the well, they're doing today. a red pair, right? The, the red, red pair is fine. I like the gold pair, essentially, from the... The, the patchwork is fine, but... Yeah. The gold they're so much better. better with different patches, different colors and shit. But, I, I thought, but how do you feel about this question, though, since we're talking? I feel like the 98s, I hope they do some amazing collaborations with Fitz to celebrate, the, what is it, 25th or 20th, yeah, whatever. whatever it is. It doesn't really matter what it is. <clears throat> but, you know, the 98s have more panels than the 97, so I'm hoping for, like, uh, better color more, blocking maybe. and better fucking premium materials instead of the bullshit oh that we usually get from Nike. But, I, I did mention that I tried on a 98 at West. My 98 that's preen collabed with is shaped differently towards the mid body oh. than the one I tried on at West. Like the, the Nike pair is wide, mm -hmm. super wide. Like I it like, the like way I was wearing Supreme. a pillow. Yeah, I like the way those fit me. The Supreme ones fit better. But the, the inline shit fits a little different. Yeah. Oh. Like it's I more snug or? It, it's way more snug in the mid body. It looks fat in the middle of your foot. Huh. Looked like I was wearing a pillow. Okay. Or maybe because it's still brand new and you didn't break them in yet. Yeah, but I'm, what is, that's going to make it look wider once it breaks in. Mm. That's not good. It was also maybe half a size people. small, so maybe... Oh, you want half size small? I, did, I didn't buy them because I didn't get my size. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, so, I mean, shout out to the dude that went and picked up the 10.5, though, because that was the one I tried on. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> I broke them in for you. Anyway, uh, I guess you want to do sneaker battle? What do you, got? you want to talk about anything? Oh, do you, do you have something you want to talk about? Yeah, you said my emphasis were whack, though. So. Just say it. I mean, it doesn't have to be... I was just saying, like, how, you know, IG has made, like, the sneaker culture, like, a competition rather than people supporting it, and, like, how outsiders view us like we should all be sticking together rather than like sticking together in what aspect like, like reselling no, or sticking like, together like, like in a community and supporting each other supporting what like I say like okay so we shoot this show like people I don't know support it more than people I actually do know like they won't say nothing about it or even acknowledge it or even watch it yeah well they probably watch it but they don't acknowledge it and people that I don't know like Send me DMs, support me, say nice things. They, sh they took their shot. Yo, what's that face? Safe! <laughs> Safe landing. Slid in the DMs yeah. over safe. Uh, whatever. No, no, I got it, I got it. I'm here with you. Fuck it. What I was going to say is this. In, in regards to what you're saying, there's a lot of infiltrators. It's like Bridge of Spies. So you got people that are core members of the community and uh, some are very guarded and some don't want new people in. Some are very open like myself. I'm I like, guarded. I like to have people come. Like if I could teach you something new or you, I could share something with you, please, but more than welcome to. That's cool. And then you have people that infiltrate the, the uh, community that want to <coughs> do shady shit. Uh, they want to exploit its weaknesses or, oh, you guys really like this shoe that's coming out. So some guy's going to go buy 20 of them so you guys can't get them and then sell them to you. Like... Uh, you got people who are just vultures that come in to uh, use the culture to promote things that they don't really even care about. It's just yes, not a good They don't make money. The culture just, vultures. You, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I feel as though... I, I get what you're saying. You well, asked money the question. Makes, money makes insignificant things important. But, but you, you asked the question. I, I know, saying. but I was just saying. That I was trying to say something else. But I'm just going to drink my Red Bull. It took over. So I'm going to finish with you. That's my time, Mike. You can keep going. I got to look at my phone anyways. Oh, yeah. well, Gotta be say. real. Everybody's doing what everybody else is doing rather than doing what they want to do. Everybody's doing it for the likes. Exactly, like. And the repost. Like the hype beast shit. That's what everybody likes, the hype beast shit. I get, but I don't know. I like hype beast shit. I view it differently, I guess, because I, I like certain hype beast shit, but I don't. Well, Mike, why, you, tell, tell everybody what you said. You're not a collector. You, you buy stuff because. Honestly, like, I started buying this. shoes because <laughs> I like to look fresh. Look good, feel good, do good. That was like my original. Thing. I, I mean, I, I don't know what nobody, I don't think anybody starts because they're like, oh man, I want to just have a room full of shoes that I'm not going to wear all the time. Like, nobody, even the no, nobody starts doing that. I like, believe you, I believe it all started with like hip hop. Uh, all right. So, like, in, in the sneaker culture, took like a, in regards to that, I'm saying well, me personally. He wasn't born before hip hop. 
I started liking shoes because I liked the way <laughs> it made old. my fit look. Like it made me look good or made me feel good about what I was wearing. So you know you buy a pair of shoes and you go, those shoes will look really good with this outfit. And I still do that to this day. <clears throat> like if I like a shoe, it's because I can envision wearing it with something and be like, oh, that's gonna look fucking dope. Mm. Like that that's how I like that's why my collection grows. Not because I'm trying to collect shoes, but because I'm trying to have a repertoire of shoes I can wear when I wanna look fucking dope. Like that's just my like to correlation. Wear different every day. I don't know about. Okay, well, I just want to look good. Like sometimes I wear the same shoe three days in a row because I can put a fit together that when? looks good with those shoes. What are you talking about? Those off whites that were like when I first got them, I wore them three days in a row. Yeah. To make the difference. So now we're bringing up off white again. What? I mean, why the fuck Yo, not? Count how many times we, Mike and Tones did off whites. You too. No, I was listening to YouTube. <laughs> oh, can we do? A, can we do a sneaker battle? Mike yeah, let's, video let's do the sneaker battle. Come on, I'm, I'm, I'm over this entire shit today. Let's do the sneaker battle. Who's going first? Uh, KB, she wins every week. So. <laughs> it's her show now, so. All right. Oh, there's green in that shoe. Ah, oh, fuck! You gotta leave it like. I got, I got some glamour shots for this one. Uh, ha! That was pretty funny. Super green. I don't uh, even get up. Everybody knows. You want to talk about it so I can throw some pictures? It's out? a super green. Ronnie released them first, and they what, went to eighty for um what was a non-release. For, for what? <laughs> They didn't release here the first time. Why did they get released in Asia? Donde está like, el telephone? Yo, I got super greens on people. All right, cool. I think I go next because you, yeah, you go next. All right. Oh, you're taking it off. You're just gonna put glamour shots. <laughs> That's a very good point. Or I might just. I'm the only one here that gets the low budget shit. <laughs> Boink. Uh, I'll throw them up here. It's probably gonna get caught up with the green screen, so I'll take. Like you said, glamour shots. Uh, silver screens <laughs> glamour from shots. the 25th anniversary. Highs and wait, these highs and lows? Highs and lows, right? Yeah, how? Yeah. Today was a bad day, I think, guys. Today was a good day! I got you big jelly fives. Bam. Oh, fuck. You big jelly fives? I'm not doing that. I'm gonna Midnight make Blossom? I make it rip Midnight Bloom? Comments. What is it? Midnight Blossom? One of my first jelly fives. She's fire. Right <laughs> <laughs> <I'm laughs> <like this. laughs> you grip that shit like, oh. <laughs> Never! Stop playing with me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he hits girls. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put so in my why are you so annoying today? You're not allowed to drink Red Bull anymore. Ever again when you're annoying. Red Bull! Two. 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 To one. Who's Who one? One. I don't know. One somebody, or two. Somebody would give me a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Juan. Does he have a, an Instagram? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who is this mystery guy that you're talking about? I just made myself dizzy screaming. Well, I gotta fight. What's wrong with you, though? No more Red Bull. I gotta go in my DMs. Damn. <laughs> There's Juan! So many, there's so many. Shoot your shot. One. Two. <laughs> four. Hold on. Yeah, how far are you scrolling back? The Jesus. Way, last week. Four. Juan is who? He has no who? photo. Who? Juan is who? Juan is two. Juan is who? <laughs> That's not nice. He's a fan of the show and you're talking shit. I'm not talking shit. Who yeah. makes fun of you, Tony, my voice? Everybody makes fun of me. He's fucking Samoan. Who cares? I'm are Mexican. Are you Samoan? No, I'm not. Come on, though. Stop telling people I'm Samoan. I thought you were. No, I'm, I'm Dominican and Mexican. He really wants to be the guy. He wants to be Cal Drago. He wants really, to be fucking, fucking Moana. What, what's, what's his name? I don't know his name. <laughs> it's fucking Moana over here. Yeah. Moana's uh, dead or... Shout out to the group chat. <laughs> we here. OG Yo, fam. Shout out to Red Bull. Mike's not allowed to drink anymore. Cause coming he's down. <laughs> he's coming down. <laughs> I'm coming down. I need more. Yeah. I think we're done here, right? Shout out to everybody that fucks with us and supports us. Follow K Black on IG and Twitter. You got water. Twitter? Yes, you got it. Shout out to Mike and the Red Bull. Follow the camp Shout out. Shout out to whoever told us to drink Red Bull by the show. Yeah, it was supposed to be for her, and I've been drinking it. They're, they're fucked up right now. You sure there's not vodka in there? No, no man. Red Bull gets. That's Red Bull and vodka. I drank it too fast, I think. Oh, yeah. That's a lot of sugar. I, I downed it before phone. the episode. He so threw sure. his iPad. Yeah, this is. He cursed me out. Shout out to Tone, he Tone of my voice. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Um, I think we're done, right? Shout out to Milton the Flavors. Shout out to. Uh, shout out to Boston's Best. Got you both. The fuck? Yeah, I think the show's over. I'm not allowed to shout out Paulo? No, right, only, only to Juan. Oh, no. uh, Why is there so much hate in here today? I think the episode's over. <laughs>